In many of our previous fossil hunts, the commonest fossil we find is ammonites, and that is simply because ammonites are the commonest fossil around here. However, I thought I'd put together a video showing lots of different fossils. So in this video, there's only a very small handful of ammonites, and the rest are completely different fossils, ranging from belemnites, fossil bone, fossil teeth, and even a chocolate ammonite. So it's going to be quite different to usual, it's just a compilation of clips to show some of the different types of fossils that we tend to find. This first fossil is an ichthyosaur rib, one that we lifted out from some shale. This next fossil here is a fossil belemnite, which is one of the squid-like creatures. And this was showing in some shale as well. We decided to reveal it carefully with our hammer and chisel. These fossils almost always naturally have little fractures through them. It's very common for these to just break into two or three pieces at least, and then glue them when we get back home. This specimen in particular had one little fracture present, so we glued this after shooting the video. This nodule that we opened up, we were almost certain it was going to contain a lovely ammonite fossil. However, to our surprise and disappointment, it didn't contain anything at all, apart from a little bit of calcite. That was a real shame. It was still very fun to open up. This fossil is a little piece of jet, or fossilised wood, wood that's quite often used and Probably made into jewellery in Whitby. Well. This clip is from a longer video that I've been working on, which shows revealing an ichthyosaur vertebra from a shale slab. Hopefully we're able to prepare it with the tools and if it prepares up nicely I'll try and put together a complete video showing the vertebra from start to finish. This ammonite is made completely from chocolate and is one that someone sent me from another country as a little gift. It's really nice to receive this, very inventive. I sent them an ammonite and in return they used it to make this mould. I think it's a really good job they've done, certainly very unique.
Here's another nodule which we thought was going to open up with something really lovely inside. However, inside was something we didn't expect, and it was a coprolite, also known as fossil faeces. Just been out fossil hunting and found quite a few ammonites, and also Shay has found a pretty rare fish jaw. You can see there the jaw itself and all of the little teeth. So we're very happy with that find and what we found today. Similar to that little fish jaw, he has another couple of jaws also containing sharp teeth. This jaw in particular is from a Jurassic fish. The next couple of fossils are parts of ammonites. The first one is very iridescent and has a lovely blue colour to one of the outer worlds. And the second specimen is incredibly piratised, making it look like it's made out of gold. The last fossil of this video is this string of articulated ichthyosaur vertebrae. This is one of the projects we've had ongoing for quite some time. It's a very long preparation process, but bit by bit we're exposing all of the bones. It's looking really good so far and I think my dad's doing a really good job. Hope you've enjoyed this episode, something a little bit different. I'll see you in the next one. That's amazing!